We are back. We are in the top 100. We're about 200 to 300 points away from number one. So let's go ahead and get some more games on the random battles that are on Pokemon Showdown. And hopefully we can hit 2300. Hopefully, yeah, we can definitely hit 2300. Maybe even go further than that. But definitely 2300 is going to be the goal by the end of the episode. Okay, we are back. And not a, not a horrible lead matchup. I do like Espeon because of magic bounce can be really dangerous in random battles. We don't particularly switch in well into Kyurem. We don't really have a resist because uh, Bronzong is weak to fire, for example, right? This can have Earth Power. I think I'm just going to knock it. I can play rough too. Hmm. I'm going to knock off to remove maybe an item. Maybe it's choice specs or something, right? 29. Heavy duty boots. Okay. Ice Beam coming in. Earth Power. Okay, that's fine. Now we can play rough. And if we can remove Kyurem, I'll be happy. But honestly, they probably switch out too. They're 23 12. I think they might switch out. Should I go to Bronzong on an Earth Power? They won't even Earth Power. They'll Ice Beam, right? I think I'm going to play rough. They do switch out, okay? Uh, we don't match up particularly well. It is Intimidate, so it could be a Stealth Rock variant. We'll go Espeon on Stealth Rock Mawile here. Oh, it didn't work. Um, we don't take too much damage. At the same time, we take too much damage. We'll go to Marowak on, for example, Iron Head. Play rough. Uh, we have to... We can Flare Blitz. They might Stealth Rock. Oh, they're Life Orb, right? So they might even Sucker Punch right now. Into Dragalge. They outspeed, unfortunately. We have a counter, but giving up Toxic Spice would be too, too big of a deal for me. I want to make a predict. I'm going to predict the no Toxic Spikes and go Bronzong on, for example, Draco. Okay, good. Now we go to Espeon, because we're covered, like we won't take too much damage now. The Kyurem is still going to be a problem. Okay, they go to Conkelder. So I'm, it's looking like my Espeon can win the game, right? Good versus Mawile, uh, Drag Algae, Kyurem is weak. So I have to make a decision, do I Dynamax now to remove Conkelder? I do believe Dynamax and Wood Kale, let's check. I don't even need to Dynamax, it's a 50% chance to KO even without Dynamaxing, but 50% is a big risk for probably the best Pokemon on my team. I could go Zerora, um, get some Recoil, and then it all Zerora would also cover any switch. So I don't know I don't know if they're gonna risk the Conkolder here or not. So I'm gonna go Zerora. I don't know if they're gonna risk Conkolder right now. They don't, good. They go to Mawile, which is interesting. I don't, at this point, I don't think it's Stealth Rock. I'm just going to Plasma Fist. They Sucker Punch. We get some chip damage. Mainly looking at Espeon right now to try and win the game. We can... Flame Charge or should we Poltergeist? Let's Poltergeist. Predicting Dragalge. Or, no, let's Flame Charge. It'll cover Mawile, and if they go Dragalge, we'll outspeed it. If they Sucker Punch here, I'm okay with that because I get the chip damage I need for Espeon. Yeah, I'm fine with this because I get the chip damage I need for Espeon. Oh, died. Okay, good. Now, what do you go to here? We have a speed boost. We'll get good damage on Dragalge. What I'm scared about is what if... Okay, so they go to Darm Galar, which unfortunately does outspeed Espeon. We simply go to Bronzong here. Yeah, definitely. Okay, good. Now we'll go to Espeon predicting Conkelder. There we go. Is it time to Dynamax yet? No. Ooh, they have a Victini. We will check if that's Assault Fest or not, because that's a very important detail. It is Assault Fest, which... Ooh, that's tricky now. Definitely tricky now. Assault Fest Victini definitely complicates things. Will I have to look for the Unpheasant win with, like, a Dynamax, right? I think you almost have to V-Create here, or you could U-Turn, I guess. We'll go Marowak on a V-Create. Blue Flare, okay. Wait, that's really good, because I can Calm Mind through Blue Flare, right? So this is great. Yeah, this is great. I can Calm Mind through the Blue Flare, okay. We'll start off with Surfetched, and we can throw off a knockoff? 
Yeah, because I think you have to switch out. This is your SP on check. You're not going to lose it here. I think you probably go Drag Algae. And the thing is, I think I would need... We are choice made. I think I would need two speed boosts to break, for example, Conkledur. I think I'm going to go for it. I don't need to Dynamax Espeon. I can Dynamax Surfetch too. You always switch Bikini out because you need Bikini for Espeon and you don't know what I'm going to do, right? I, d I definitely think... Oh, you stay in. Interesting. Okay. Now we're going to get one more speed boost. Great. Victini chip down as well. You go to Drag Algae as expected. We're going to get another Airstream off. Now we outspeed the entire team. And it looks good. And it's a clo free close combat, right? Yeah. Okay. So you go to Conkluder. I think I have to Brave Bird now. I can't close combat. I need, I need to Brave Bird. Uh, good ship damage though, because uh, Bronzong can potentially beat Darm and Kiram, right? They Dynamax Conkluder, which is very interesting to me, because now Espeon would KO it, right? Yeah, Espeon KOs Conkluder now, so I think that was a very, very interesting Dynamax here. I felt maybe they felt like they needed to, to break uh, Surfetched. Okay, what do you go here? You go to Victini. Does this have U-Turn? Is it going to U-Turn me, or is it going to Blue Flare me? I think we always Shadow Ball, right? Okay, that KO'd. Good. Now, you go to Curum White, okay, but I don't care about Curum White. I have Calm Mind, okay. Oh, are they going for the Freeze? Okay, good. Now we start Psyching. 56, okay, good. Special Defense drop, good. I mean, it didn't matter, right? Um, I do not want to keep risking the Freeze chance right now. So we will Psychic. Yep, okay. Now, this looks like it's Choice Scarf, but it could always not be Choice Scarf, right? There could be like a bluff, right? Um, so I'm thinking of going Unpheasant on a U-turn, right? Is that the idea? I wanna go I wanna go Unpheasant on a U-turn so it covers Conkelder, but I also don't wanna lose to a Salic Berry. Belly drum? Substitute, Earthquake, Icicle Crash. Even if it is Salad Berry, Bronzong should wall it. So I'm going to go on Pheasant on a U-turn. That did not work. We'll go to Bronzong here. That did not work. Ooh, should I Brave Bird predicting the Conkledur switch? I'm not that risky. No, I, I it's an overpredict. Brave Birding here would be an overpredict. I'm just going to go to Bronzong. At the same time... Hmm. Nah, I'm going to go Bronzong. It's an overpredict to Brave Bird. Is it though? I could Brave Bird to sacrifice and then go Bronzong and Iron Head Darm. And Iron Head would be doing too much to Conkelder, right? I'm just gonna go Bronzong. Bronzong. They belly drum. Okay. So they wear the Salic variant. There, there's no way they're Flare Blitz, right? I mean, Fire Punch. Right. Cool. Okay. That doesn't KO, are you kidding me? Oh, what a choke. I for sure thought that would KO. Oh no. We have to, oh no, what a choke. Choke, choke, choke. Oh, and we lose 17 rating points. Let's keep going. Okay. We have the Darm Galar here, okay. We can all ooh, but this can be lightning rod. So we do have Willow on Rotom, so not a big deal. Yeah, we have a counter. Okay. They're twenty three thirty nine, so we can make up a lot of points if we win this game here. Okay, Rotom. Yeah, we can Willow. Okay. Shift three has always been trash for me. It could Dynamax maybe, but Heracross okay. Slowbro great. Luxray always trash. I think Darm Galar, I, I love Rotom, Darm Galar could be interesting here. We'll definitely Willow, okay. We get knocked off, uh, we'll Hydro here. This could be Swift Swim, but I don't want to risk it. Okay. We can even go Heracross now, we do outspeed, right? Okay. Uh, this is a free facade, right? Yeah. 
Okay, so all in all, we took about, you know, oh, okay, not good, not good. So, we do have Shiftry, so, ooh, if this is choice locked, it's easy to deal with, right? Should I go to Shiftry on a Dark Pulse? I mean a Shadow Ball, rather? That was a horrible decision. And now the problem is that Blacephalon can Dynamax here. So it, it can Dynamax through Slowbro, for example, right? Um, hmm. Let's go to Rotom again. And I think we have to Dynamax Water to counter their Dynamax Shadow. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Ooh, that does too much. We don't have anything, like, we have literally the only team in the world that is just way too slow to handle anything. What a nightmare. We'll try Luxury, maybe you can live a Shadow Ball or something. Okay, they switch out. We get burned, okay. We don't have Crunch. We can go to Heracross to knock off, though. And we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to find a situation where we can set up Darmgalar, basically, right? We'll go to Slowbro. We'll go for a Scald Burn on Corsola, and then we'll try and teleport into Darm. We want to figure out a way to Belly Drum. But we can't because of Haze, right? Haze will always stop us. They're scared of Toxic here. In fact, they're so scared of Toxic, I'm gonna teleport on the Switch Out. Because they should be scared of Toxic. Okay, maybe not. So this is good news, right? No, it's not. They can still have Haze, so it doesn't mean anything. They are knocked off, though. I don't think you ever Willow here because I could substitute on you, right? You don't ever Willow. So I'm going to crash 42 flinch. Oh, we get... We, we get the flinch, but... We'll try and bluff like we're Scarf, right? Let's go to Slowbro again. Like, we look Scarf now. If I switch out, it's like, oh, you're disabled, right? So we'll go back to Slowbro. Okay, so they're not scared of Scarf. We can also go for an Ice Beam Freeze here. In fact, oh, never mind. But I thought maybe that could have been an idea. Okay, that worked. We'll go to Luxray now. Maybe we have, an, we have a way of breaking it. We'll have to Agility here, and they have to be scared out, right? We can Agility to outspeed Blacephalon. Okay. Wild Charge, do your thing. Ooh. And we get, we get disabled again. Will they? I feel like, I feel like they're gonna go Arctovish here, predicting Slowbro. Let's go Heracross, Butterfree. Okay. Yeah, same concept. They're gonna try and predict Slowbro. Um. Facade. Into Corsola. They're going to. Uh, night. Oh, night. I thought they would strength up. Okay. We can Ice Beam here. Slack off one. Ooh, didn't work. We have to go for the freeze now. Uh, do we? I mean, yeah, we kind of do. Oh, no, no. I hope I hope Luxor can live a hit. I don't know if it does. I mean, Luxor has decent special defense. Nothing great, but it should live one hit, right? Oh, we die. We just die. Oh, God. We'll try Darm here. Um, yeah, we just, we just Icicle Crash here. We look Scarf too, so maybe they'll switch out. Okay. Okay. Now we're triggered. We outspeed Blacephalon, but we, there's no way we break Arctivish. Yeah. We can Scald Burn. No, it's Water Absorb, right? We don't know if it's Water Absorb. It is Water Absorb. Yeah, we lose to Blacephalon now. Uh, let's try one more game. We have enough time for one more game, right? I don't want to lose two in a row. I mean, I don't want to lose more than two in a row. We do have Seismitoad, which is a counter. Great. Uh, we can Rain Dance. These don't have Grass Knot, so we can definitely Rain Dance here. You go to Audino, which is a counter, unfortunately. Mmm... 
So Urshifu can substitute on Arduino, which is great. And we have like the rain combination, which is great. Uh, I'm gonna go Sigalyph on Toxic. Or that, okay. We will get knocked off. I'm gonna go Pissimian on a knockoff here. I think it's much better if it's no if it doesn't have to be locked in. In general, I do like a knocked off Pissimian. Great, now we can close combat. Ooh, that's so trash. They wish to. Good thing they didn't toxic. That is such a trash move. Maybe I did need that choice band, huh? They wish again. Um. Now they should be really scared. Like, I did 74, like, last time. Yeah, there we go. And we have the Urshifu. Um, we can straight up substitute, right? I mean, you have to... No, no, no. What if they trick me? I don't want them to trick me. Will Wicked Blow. Okay, you go to Terrakion. We don't switch in too well. In fact, it outspeeds our entire team. Ooh, it outspeeds our entire team. Um, what do we do? We could go to Sigalyph on a fighting type move, right? Maybe it's Choice Banded. It is Life Orb, okay. Not good. I think we sacrifice. Sigalyph is not going to be useful versus Pikachu, Audino, and Caldrix, right? So we can just Psychic here. They Stone Edge, fine by me. We'll have to force it out with Seismitoad. So we'll Earthquake into probably Audino coming in. Okay, so we removed Terrakion, which is great for Urshifu right now. Um, I think I'm always going to lead Kabutops, right, into, for example, Caldrix. I want to knock things off, basically. I mean, no, actually, they're definitely going to lead Pikachu, right? They're going to lead Pikachu, so I'm going to lead... Yeah. Now we can Earthquake into anything, really, but... I'm going to close combat. Eighty-six. They wish. Now I'm gonna go to Urshifu. Okay. Now we can substitute. Oh my god. Oh, static is so annoying too. I feel like. Do I go for the win right now? Like I bulk up a few times, right? I'm, I think I go for the win right now. Right? They're gonna go for the discharge play. I don't I'm gonna I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna break through now. Um Yeah, I'm gonna try and break through now. I wanna minimize the chances of a discharge paralysis here. So I wanna try and two-hit KO if I can. We do have a great matchup versus Audino and Calrith Shadow. And Drain Punch can keep us healthy versus Pikachu spamming Volt Switch, for example. How much are we doing here? 63, good. Discharge, don't. Okay, good. Yeah, I think we can break through now. Okay. Now what do you go to? You will probably have to Dynamax as well. I'm thinking Pikachu could Dynamax right now, maybe? Or maybe not? Ooh, that's big damage. You have to sacrifice Caloric Chat. Ooh, you don't. That's a bad decision because now I can substitute. Right? Now we can substitute again on a Volt Switch, right? Oh, they outspeed me. No, but this doesn't have. This doesn't have an attacking move, right? So we can Drain Punch to heal, basically. Okay? Should we do it again? We could do it again, right? If you go to Caloric Shadow... Yeah, great. 41 only. We substitute again on a Volt Switch, right? Okay. So now we have to Wicked Blow. Does that even break sub? It does, okay. Pikachu comes back. Mm, we definitely need to keep Urshifu alive because it beats Audino and Meowstic. Really great matchup, to be honest. We don't need Pissimian, it's too weak at this point. 
Dynamax probably. Pikachu does not Dynamax. Uh, this feels like another mistake, because now... You, you, the one thing you cannot do is you cannot let me Urshifu, right? Uh, we can Wicked Blow predicting Pikachu. Or an, oh my god. I choked. I thought for sure if I was substituting, you would go to Pikachu. I choked. We'll bulk up on a Protect. Or not, we can just Wicked Blow again, but... We have to Rapid Spin once, right? Will they Volt Tackle? They might just Volt Tackle here. Now we Geomancy. Oh my god, we choked three games in a row. 2206. I'm gonna end the episode. That was horrible. We choked two games in a row. And yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching.